Hey folks, I wanted to give the deep water culture hydroponics a try. From all the methods that I've looked at on the hydroponics, it looks like the deep water culture in some buckets are probably the quickest and the easiest to put together. Uh, you basically take the bucket, uh, put a, uh, an aeration line into it, get a lid with a net pots built in it, and off you go. Uh, I've put together a couple here and I had three cuttings left from the garden that I'd taken from some suckers uh, some suckers off a tomato plant and so I thought I'd do a side-by-side -side comparison. Now, I know this isn't a uh, sure enough comparison that's really going to stand up to anything. I'd, I wouldn't trust the results just off of, of one trial run with three plants but I figured I had one, I plant it in the container with the potting mix, and two, I put in the deep water culture, so I was gonna, and they're all about the same size, so I was gonna do a little side-by-side -side comparison as they grow. I put these in about a week ago. I've got a little aquarium pump, you see sitting in between the two uh, deep water culture buckets there that I bought. It was about $10. I'm running basically that same pump into my fish tank on the aquaponics as well. Uh, it puts out quite a bit of air. I think that would probably, if you got some splitters, I really think that one pump would probably run four of these barrels. Uh, it's a three and a half watt pump. If I did the math right, I think it was 286 hours that it would take to equal one kilowatt hour of electricity. So uh, in a nutshell, if I did the numbers right, it, it looks like that pump will run uh, a week and a half for 10 to 15 cents of electricity uh, it's probably a little under a dollar's worth of solution that I've got in each bucket I just wanted to give it a try I've been wanting to experiment with the hydro, uh, hydroponics in and so the deep water culture was the quickest and easiest to put together in these buckets uh, so I'm gonna give them a try and see how they go compared to each other and I'll keep you posted on the results. Thanks for watching.